rubber tubing, gas, saw, gloves, cuffs, razor wire, hatchet, lattice, and my mitts. We're close enough. Pull over. Yes, Mara. Keep the engine running. If I'm not back in 20 minutes, you get the hell out of here. Don't look back. Kill him for me, Mara. Kill him good. I won't let you down, Goldie. Heading downstairs to the kitchen, getting himself a midnight snack. And I can guess what kind. Try to slow my heart down and breathe the fire out of my lungs. My muscles make me a thousand promises of pain to come. Let me do it, Marv. She was my sister. Let me finish him. You wasn't supposed to come down here, Wendy. Oh, but I want to. I'm sorry, kid, but I haven't even started with this creep. And I don't want you watching the rest. It'll give you nightmares. Ah, I gotta tell you, I'm good bushed. It's not that fight of ours that did me in either. It's all that sawing and tying. It's not as easy as it looks. Could have been a real mess around here if I didn't have that tubing for tourniquets. I, mean, I gotta admit, there was a spurt or two. You get the scent in the air. If you get that friend of yours to come running. Hello. No. Look who's here. Here he comes. It's a good dog. He doesn't scream. Not even when the mutt's had its fill and Kevin's guts are lying all over the place. And somehow the bastard is still alive, still staring at me. Not even when I grab the saw and finish the job. He never screams. <laughs> 